Today by Nutri-Grill we're having Korean style barbecue ribs and garlic roasted potatoes. We have the um, uh, ribs here, beef ribs. We have some Korean barbecue sauce and garlic potatoes. Just some uh, chopped garlic and some olive oil. And we have some mixed peppers here, red, green, onion. Let's get started. We're just going to put our potatoes into the reservoir. Is that all nice? How easy is that? After about a minute, we want to add a little bit of water. We're just going to add some water to the reservoir. Next, we're going to add our beef ribs. I'm going to put those about four or five minutes aside. Let's see our water's evaporating away here. At this point, we're going to add our minced uh, <coughs> peppers. At this point, you want to season your potatoes with salt. You want to get that nice caramelization on there. It's going to seal in the flavor. Again, just want to season a little bit of salt. This is why we add the water early in the stage and it evaporates. And then what you're left with here is a nice uh, caramelization. The onion and the potato frying up really nicely. The garlic. Well, you like it a little spicy. Put yourself in a jalapeno pepper. I just happen to have one here. I'll we'll just uh, do a little cut. We've got some kitchen shears around. And now that the ribs are done, I'm just going to dip them inside our cream barbecue sauce. As for cream barbecue sauce, um, you can make build it to suit uh, your own. Paste. Mine, I just took some tomato paste, some garlic, some sesame seed oil, some brown sugar, or palm sugar, a bit of pepper and some salt, and some hot chili flakes. Oh, and our potatoes are just coming along nicely. Keep them in a little stir here and there. They get nice and crispy. Some of that oil. Now we can put those ribs. Start to see the nice caramelization of the sauce on there with the sugars. At this point, I like to come by with a little bit more sauce. Run that right into the top. Yeah, and there we have. Green style barbecue ribs with garlic, roasted potatoes.